This colder weather has been affecting farmers and ranchers across the board, including beekeepers. Colder weather makes it harder for bees to reproduce and stay alive. How you doing? It's honeybee season, and those at the Smoot Honey Company are busy bringing their bees back. Yeah, we're, we're, we're playing catch up all this last week, doing you know, two weeks worth of work in one week. And They're bringing them back much later than usual. It installed bees per our schedule that you know, the end of the week before. Anyway, it, it's the little tiny packages have a hard time in the cold like that. So April's colder weather has been affecting the bee rehoming process in more ways than one. Yeah, I was thinking Smoot Honey Company has been serving the people of Montana for over five decades, and last year was one of the worst on record. Two or three good years in a row, and then you'll have a bad year or two. Last year was our fifth worst crop ever, but our fifth worst crop was a lot better than a lot of other beekeepers that we know their crops were last year, and it was an overall not good crop for the whole United States last year. Coming off of that, this year is crucial for beekeepers like them. Historically across the United States, um, honey production is down oh, over 100 million pounds um, you know, across the board in overall production across the country. Aside from honey production, the bee population in Montana is monumental. Nuts that you eat, a lot of the fruits that you eat, or even those things as ingredients, you wouldn't be able to eat strawberry ice cream if it weren't for bees. Which is exactly why preservation and bee farming is crucial to our ecosystem. Every third bite of food is because of a bee. In Great Falls, Lindsay Stinger, MTN News.